You know, it's it's something that they're going to have to to work through because they are a better defensive team when he's off the floor. But your best player, your all star, your what he was in the top five in MVP voting last year, he's got to be on the floor. Yeah. Let, let's talk LeBron here, guys. Um, shouldn't bury the lead here right, with with the team captain. I, I guess the obvious question here first, Reggie, is is what he is doing in the regular season, which he's not had to previously do in the Eastern Conference because he could be the sixth seed and be fine. Are you worried about the sustainability of what LeBron's doing, or is he just showing us he's a different human being? He's a different human being. And truthfully, I'm jealous. <laughs> in my 18th year, I could barely get out of bed <laughs> for practice and or games. What he is doing in the later stages of his career is phenomenal. I, I don't think we've seen that in any athlete in any sport. To be this dominant, this late in his career, at the highest level. I mean, we are still considering him the best player in the game. He might not win the MVP. I think that's Jonas's. But what he is doing at his age and what the Lakers are doing, it, I, we, I've never seen that. I mean, you, that's your position. You're too, I've never seen that. To, 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 to piggyback what you're saying, I mean, as impressive as he is as a player, and, and as a human being, I think one of the most impressive things, as you said, is his longevity. Yes. He's never really had a serious injury. And he's still able to go out, forget about playing, mm -hmm. but able to go out and be athletic, able to shoulder the responsibility, yeah. being the point guard, putting in the minutes, uh, the impact that he has on both ends of the floor, and all the miles. Forget, you know, the, and everyone keeps and, saying, and the, at some point in time, he's going to slow right, down. Right. And, 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 and to you guys' point, I, I haven't seen it, Reg, because I don't think anybody had this type of responsibilities. I mean, he yeah. has to be the point guard. And I wonder about that, Reg. That takes a lot out of you, having to bring the ball up, get guys set. Leading the league in assists right now. And then you have to go score as well, because I still think, and I want Anthony Davis to be that number one guy, but at times, sometimes he has to be the number one guy, and I don't know if, it's that, if that's going to be too much on him come playoffs. I actually think, I mean, I, I think he'll, he'll be able to flip the switch in the playoffs. It's a different ball game. You got time to sort of relax, focus in, lock in. I think for him, it's just getting through the regular season. Mm -hmm. And I hate to say, and it sounds crazy, I think he's kind of on cruise control. Like he's and right. still dominating and having That's an impact. That's scary that you just said that because no, you're right. right. No, you're so, right. So, so he's got another I feel level. Like he's right. another level. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I mean, it remains to be seen. A lot can and will happen throughout the playoffs. But we saw that in Cleveland. Mm -hmm. We saw against Golden State while he took it to another level. And I just look, I still believe that he can do that and will do that when the time comes. It's funny you say that because it was, he went to eight straight NBA finals. Right? Yeah. Is it eight yeah. straight yeah. NBA four, finals? Four and four. He's looking at his watch like, you're right. You know, okay, can, can we get to April 15th? Yes. <laughs> right? Tax yes. time? Is that around the playoffs? Right, but remember, in Cleveland and, and Miami, they weren't always the number one seed, right? They could mess around. Now, the difference is in, 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 in this season, they are the number one seed in the West, and they are being pushed by other teams because there are other really great teams and I just wonder how that plays out. And on top of that, you know, the Lakers and Laker Nation too are going to be playing oh, yeah. heavy hearts, but they're playing for a different mission now too. Not to say that, you know, the, the paved road is going to be easy, but, you know, what has transpired over the last two and a half weeks with the passing of Kobe and you know, Gigi and the seven others. I think the Lakers are playing, they're going to be playing differently now. Mm -hmm. I want to get from you, we've got to go to an interview, but I want to talk to you about what, if the Lakers don't win a championship, why it would be. We'll, we'll get that in here in a second. What, what, what maybe is their Achilles heel? But first, the late ad here, due to the injury to Damian Lillard, is Devin Booker. He's standing by with Allie LaForce. Devin, have you ever faced...